What's up, YouTube? Back on the Suron today. It's been a little while. I haven't given up on my channel. I'm just taking kind of a little break. I'm waiting for my other bike to arrive. And it's been hot as hell in Houston. Yeah, I got a um, Veli Motor VMX 12 coming. Should be coming any day now. Those are the ones that are kind of, there's a similar form factor as the uh, Sir Ron, kind of a, a larger pit bike, you know, sort of size. It's got a 12 kilowatt tune, 72 volt, 40 amp hour battery. Um, it's supposed to be like super aggressive, like really, really high powered. But we'll see. Um, there's not a whole lot on the internet about it. If I like it, I'm going to sell it on my store, but I want to test it first. It's supposed to be the same as the uh, Time ET. And there's a, a YouTuber out of New Jersey that has one of those seems to like it a lot there's not a whole lot of reviews on it the belly motor or the time et not a lot of detailed videos about it either so i'll be doing a lot of those um you know top speed you know just go over all the the specs of it when i get it you know, do first ride range sport range eco all that kind of shit or if it's too early for the deers to be out but the only negative shit i've heard about it on YouTube. Um, the videos were done by people who make a living selling um, performance parts for the Suron. So I don't know, they're a little bit biased. I'm saying they're lying. But the people who own it seem to really like them a lot. That's why I'm thinking that, you know, if you can get one of those, they're retailing, I'm going to retail it for $49.99 if I sell it. A lot of the places sell it from six or seven or something like that. But oh, well, I wonder what happened there. The tree broke. Yeah, and so I'll do a bunch of videos, comparison videos and stuff like that. I got a new logo made for my channel and I'm having a professional intro made. So I'm just kind of getting getting things getting things ready for the next stage of my channel once I start getting these other bikes. I'm having a another bike built that I designed from scratch. Damn, I always go through right here, but it's all overgrown. Fucking snakes. Yeah, I uh so that one's pretty much going to be similar to the the Suron. It's going to have a similar looking frame. So it'll be in the same class as like the 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 Surons and the um, what are they called? Tolarias. Oh, there's a deer right there. Did you guys see it? It's going to look very similar. Where'd he go? He's in there somewhere. I think I got him on camera though. Nice. Um, the same. Anyways, that one's going to come very similar to this, but it's going to have everything stock that no people normally upgrade on the Surons, right? So it's going to look very similar to the Surons. It's going to be a little, a little bit wider, a little bit taller. Oh, there's another deer right there, right in front of me. You see him? Her? Hello. <laughs> Let's see if I can get a, uh, a video for a short. Got a doe just sitting there staring at me. I'm out here on my Suron. Another one passed me earlier. Nice. I'm gonna sit here and enjoy this deer and uh, maybe I'll yeah I'll just finish what I'm saying about this bike. But anyway so it's gonna be like for example it's gonna come with a three three inch riser bars. It's gonna come with a 58 tooth sprocket stock. So the motor on the Suron is 3,000 nominal 6,000 peak. This one's 6,000 nominal, 12,000 peak, so it comes stock with a 12,000 watt tune in it. There's no gears or anything, so it's, it's going to work. It's a QS motor, so those are kind of the upgraded, one of the upgrades available for the uh, Suron. So it's going to come, come stock with a QS motor, battery, and controller. So the battery is the big one. It's going to be a 72 volt, 60 amp hour, 60 amp hour battery. So it's going to have a shitload of range. So pretty much you're getting a fully upgraded Suron type bike and that's it's going to retail for 5500 bucks 
so that's in the works now i have a prototype being built as we speak I, like i said i designed it they're, they're they had a, a frame they were using they have to redo the frame because it doesn't fit the battery i wanted yeah but once it's done and shipped to me it's gonna have an mx seat so the seat will come off you'll have access to like a to the battery but it'll be a, the seat will go all the way up so you'll be able to slide uh, all the way up and down it's gonna be nice it's gonna come out 19 as well similar to this it's gonna come stock with tk um this uh 241 type tires the trials tires chinese brand but uh yeah let's see how close i can get this deer before he takes off on me you see him there Her? <laughs> I guess they're black tails. Oh, that was a treat. I'm glad it came out. I was sitting there playing video games with my friends. I decided to get out and go for a ride. Slippers and snakes. They usually don't they come out until right after dark. We got like a few minutes here before that happens, but we'll see if we can uh, if we can find any. Surprisingly, I haven't seen a, that many rabbits. Usually there's like a shit ton of rabbits. Oh, there's a rabbit right there. Yeah, so yeah, so I'm pretty excited about that. But the uh, the price on that, so basically it's gonna be, jeez, the same price as like a got a fucking bug in my ear. Jeez, right in my fucking ear. Okay, so about the equivalent of like a maybe like an eighty-five hundred dollar to nine thousand dollar Suron setup for fifty-five hundred. That's just an introductory price because they're kind of gonna be made to order at first. So there's going to be, you know, probably about eight, eight to 12 week waiting period from order to arrival of the bike. And then eventually I'll end up buying a big um, quantity of them if I get enough orders and then there's enough interest. At which time the price will probably go up to 6000 or 6500 I'm not sure. There we go. One thing I'm gonna have them do, I haven't told them yet, is to strap down the battery too. Add a strap to the battery, so that way it's not bouncing all over the fucking place when you're trying to go off road. Yeah, normally I see snakes on this cement trail here. It's probably a little early for that though. Those deers were actually out a lot earlier than they normally are. Usually they don't come out to right about night in larger groups too usually maybe they're like in between four and six yeah and the snakes i see sometimes i see garter snakes um one time i saw like a um i forget what it's called crawdad snake or some shit but mostly i see a cotton mouth like water moccasins the venomous ones yeah, I can't wait till I get that uh, belly motor, the uh, BMX 12. Those things are ridiculous too. Like, uh, you will end up on your ass in first gear, or second gear, if you, you're not careful with the throttle, because they're torquey as shit. And they, I think they go like 75 miles an hour. They probably go a lot faster than the Sauron. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Oh, yeah, check out my uh, store, fumoto.com. Selling Solaria, Suron, um, a Hyper Scooter, and then there's a, uh, what is it called? The, uh, I can't remember. But anyways, check it out. 
soon there might be the Veli motor on there or the, the uh, Time ET. I think they're exactly the same. So I think I found a, a uh, distributor that will, will ship them really fast. Faster than the Veli Moto. But if you like the style of the Veli Moto, Moto it'll take about, take about eight weeks to get it. Uh, this one will take, I think, less than four weeks for the Time ET. But uh, yeah, anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.